We've got the company, Ashanik. <laughs> Yo, what is up, guys? My name is Epi, and welcome back to Mario and Sonic Revenge on the Deadly Six. This is part three to the series, and I hope you guys are excited for this video. So let's go! All right, so basically where we left off, um, Zaz got spray gas, or not spray gas. What am I talking about? He got gas. Oh, well, he just got gas. Okay. <laughs> Okay, then come on. Let's go. I need to find my weapons first. So let's split up. I'll meet you at the interrogation room Where are we anyway? Probably some hidden base underground Right. Oh, yeah, we're underground. How are we okay? Ah Sean just knowing every single thing in the world somehow. We're in an underground base Underground what's this? We're gonna need these items Whoa, what did I just get? Water and mushroom. Okay, I have a bad feeling about that because if it if it needs to heal that much HP, then oh my god, we are in for a treat. I wonder where else to go. Oh, chest. I hope these things are loaded. All set. Oh no, he is a. Oh my god, what is this game? Let's just let's just continue because. <laughs> We've got the company, Ashanik. <laughs> Wait, oh no. Oh, now I have to fight. I can't imagine how much damage they'll do. No damage. No damage. No damage. We are impenetrable. Man, these robots are hard to fight. Mepolis must have made them stronger. Stronger. Okay. That's a new thing. That's a new word I should learn. Yeah, seriously, I don't think these bots are doing anything to us. We're just basically wasting our time here. Um, can we at least just jump over them and have no problems? Because that will save a lot of time for everyone that's watching this, and especially myself. Yay! We actually got one. Ah, uh, two more to go. Is that the best you got? Friends are trying to escape. <laughs> But I highly doubt that it <laughs> last long against those robots. Don't bet on it, asshole. Now to bring your blood sample to Zaz and Zavik. Goodbye, Iblis Trigger. <laughs> I gotta get out of here. As soon as the poison kicks in, I'll be a goner. And he's gonna go for Mario and Shonic next. Mario! Shonic! Where are you guys? <laughs> okay, just goes back into the fight. Okay. That's something new I never seen before. Okay, seriously, this is just a wasting time. Like, wow. Yay! My voice is cracked, but that's okay. This is taking a bunch of crap. Thank you, finally, about freaking time. It took me 10 years to freaking fight these. I'm okay. Moving on. Good job, Mario. Now, where could Sonic be? Mario, Sonic, where are you guys? It's Sonic. It's coming from that way. Let's go. Sonic can somehow scream like a girl. I am. Yeah, Sonic looks completely fine to me. Play next cutscene. Don't mind Took you me. long enough. Now get me the f out of here. What? Lasers, really? Mephilus is gone. I don't know about Zaz and Zadik. They're catching some Z's. <laughs> you give such awesome one-liners. I learned so much from James Bond. <laughs> Sonic, are you okay? The uh, poison. Mephilus tortured me pretty good. Ow! Uh, that wound looks bad. Let me... Don't touch it! It's poison! Poison? He stabbed me with a poison dagger. Now hurry up and get me to a hospital for you. <laughs> Sonic! Oh, mamma mia! Shonic. The poison's already kicking in, and sh I forgot me instant cure for stage supplies. <laughs> oh God! Be okay, Mario. Go back to the hotel and wait for me there. I'm gonna take Sonic to the hospital. But the Shonic, go! Mario. Just hang in there, Sonic. Keep your eyes on me, Sonic. I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> I'm sorry. I should be laughing, but that that voice is just 
way too good. <laughs> oh, well, he's okay. See, no problems. He's in the ER. What? Where am I? The hospital. Duh. You're awake. What happened to me? You're in a hospital. How do you feel? Exactly what that. That's why I said. I feel like Frodo after he got stabbed with a mortal blade in the Fellowship of the Ring. The doctors were able to get most of the poison out. Had the poison reached your heart, you would have been done for. How bad is it now? Fortunately, you didn't lose too much blood, and the antidote is working. But you should rest. Rest. An oxygen mask. There's still a little bit of poison in your lungs. The doctors are doing their best to get it out. So whatever you do, don't take that mask off. What if I need to eat or drink water? Just sleep. I'll have to take this mask off to do that, won't I? I don't think eating is a good idea right now with the poison in you. The last thing we want for you is to be vomiting all over the place. Besides, if you take that oxygen mask off, you'll be dead in 30 seconds. D dead in 30 seconds? <coughs> Hang in there, Sonic. Deep breaths. Sonic, am I gonna die? No. No. See? <laughs> Or are you just saying that just as words of encouragement when in reality I actually am gonna die? I'm being totally honest. You are not going to die. The antidote takes time. I believe you'll be back on your feet in two days. The Olympics are going on. Everybody needs me to compete again. And here I am, in a hospital bed, wearing an oxygen mask because there's poison in my lungs. I can't miss out. I'm sorry, Sonic, but you're in no condition to play in the Olympics right now. Uh. Sonic? It hurts so much, Sonic. I know it does. Just hang in there. The sooner I get out of here, the better. You're hurt, Sonic. You need to stay in that bed and rest. And do not take off that oxygen mask. Where's Mario? Dad. Back at the hotel. Never mind. I'm gonna say when I don't compete in any Olympic games for two days. I'm gonna take your place in the Olympics for the next two days. What? What about Zaz? What about Zavik? What about Mephilus? They're winning. They have my blood. They're gonna bring back the other deadly six. I have to be ready for when they arrive. They will not hurt you, or Mario, or Tails, or Amy, or Styx, or Luigi, or Samantha. I'm sorry, who's Samantha? That their plan will be hashed after the closing ceremony. So, I have to keep training to prepare myself for my ultimate destiny. That is, as soon as I get out of this damn hospital and I've recovered, which will be in two days. I'm gonna go back to Mario. Sonic, please stay. Don't go. I'm not going to leave you, Sonic. Good. Just go to sleep. The doctors will take care of you. They better. I f***ing hate hospitals. I know you do, Sonic. And I look like a cross between Darth Vader and Bane in this oxygen mask. I promise you will be out of this hospital in two days' time. Just come back and visit me. I will. I promise you. Meanwhile! Our mission is complete. While I was interrogating Sonic, I managed to get a sample of his blood. Are you ready to see your four friends again? You bet I am! <gasps> oh my god! It's so HD! Master Zick, the depressing guy, the female. My friends, you have returned. You fool. <laughs> Sonic. Let's get these girls out. Yes, Hedgehog. <laughs> Hedgehog for the last time. So, <laughs> where are we? You are in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. What are we doing all the way in Brazil? The Olympic Games are coming, <laughs> and Sonic is here. I'm sorry. <laughs> Pathetic. It's so bad. Tries to wipe the earth of its energy, and oh my
That sticks its voice actor, isn't it? I wonder if we have tasted now or had delicious food. My obese friend. Oh, he's friend. To take over the world, and you can all have revenge on Sonic. You never told us who you are. I'm Mephilus. Mephilus the Dark. I am an ancient incarnation of Solaris, the sun god of Solion. With a bad voice. With ancient power and a bit of Sonic the Hedgehog's blood. Sonic's blood has made you even more powerful than before. Brilliant. Sonic may have gotten away from you this time, but next time, he'll think twice before crossing paths with Mephilus the Dark. Dad, how much longer do these Olympic Games go? One and a half weeks, so ten days! Good. We will hatch our master plan in ten days, right when the closing ceremonies are taking place. We will place another extractor right in the middle of the stadium. Extra- of um, what? There, we'll all be dead. Even Sonic and his puny friends, Zaz and Zavik, keep training for the Olympics. But don't make contact with Sonic or his Italian plumber friend Mario. As you wish, master! I will bring forth demons from the dimension of Iblis, and you will supply me with some of Dr. Eggman's robots. Remember, meet me outside of the stadium at midnight during the closing ceremonies, as soon as the Olympic flames is extinguished. That is when the real fireworks will begin. Hope Sonic is ready to face his death on two knees. <laughs> <laughs> Wahoo! Hi. Hi, Amy. Hey, Sonic. Have you seen Sonic anywhere? Sonic isn't feeling well, so I'm gonna take his place for the next couple of days. What happened? The omelet he ate this morning had some undercooked meat in it, and it was puking all over the place. What happened really, Sean? Yeah, Sean, like, you really think that's gonna fool Amy? Did Sonic tell you about a threat coming? Oh, you mean with those Zaz and Zavok creatures? Yes. Did they try to hurt Sonic? Not only them, but another friend. <laughs> but another enemy from his past. Who? Mephilus the Dark. He's a creepy lookalike of Shadow. He has no mouth, no feet, red and green eyes, and crystallized skin. He's an incarnation of Solaris, the sun god of Soliana, and he killed Sonic one time. Are you talking about a nightmare? I had one time where I saw Sonic in dead in front of me and this creepy lookalike of Shadow killed him. Yes, Amy, Mephilus is real and he's out there right now. He will not stop until Sonic is dead. <clears throat> so this Mephilus guy, did he actually hurt Sonic? Yes! Yes, he tortured him and stabbed him with a poison dagger. Sonic is in the hospital right now, but the doctors are doing the best they can to get the poison out and give him enough antidote. He's probably going to be back on his feet in two days. At least he's going to be alright. But for now, I'm going to take his place in the Olympics for the next two days. Okay then, tell Sonic to get well soon. I will, Amy. Baba. Okay. Wait. No! No! Come on! I was hoping it would be something different. Ah! My game just... My game is responding now. I pressed the enter key way too fast. That's making my game not respond. Are you freaking kidding me? And it made my game crash. Okay, I pressed the enter key so hard it made my game crash. <laughs> I didn't even save. Oh my god. I didn't even save. Oh my god, no. Oh, be right back. Oh, dear god, my hand is getting tired after spamming the enter key. Ah. Come on! Thank you! Okay, I'm back and I'm never gonna talk to Amy twice because somehow my my enter key pressing skills make the game crash. Ah! Hi, Boozer. I heard Sonic got into the hospital. Yeah, what's it to you? I actually hope he died. Hey, Mario. Hey, is Sonic. Hey, Mario. Is Sonic gonna be okay? I'm sure he will be, Mario. He's gonna be better in two days. As soon as he recovers, we'll devise a plan to take down Mephilus and the Deadly Six. Sonic should not have to fight them alone. He will have to fight them alone because I am with him to the end of the line. I got that from Captain America the Winter Soldier. Oh my god, that's the best scene in Captain America the Winter Soldier. I never seen that movie, but okay. I know, right? Isn't that such a perfect quote? It most definitely is Mario. Should we go and pay Sonic a visit at the hospital? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Oh yeah, I I was just at the hospital, like you don't mind. I I I decide maybe I want to go back there, you know. Don't tell me this is the hospital. It's the hospital. 
Hello? Oh, here we go again. Right, hopefully Sonic is doing okay. Well then! The hell? What is it, Sonic? Sonic is gone. Where could he be? Probably in the bathroom. Sonic? Sonic, are you in there? Sonic? He's not here. He couldn't be dead, the Sonic. I know that. What the hell are you doing, Sonic? Using the greens out of the cube to find Sonic. Let's see. Ash. No, I didn't want Sonic drive in restaurant. God, I hate it when the green side does this to me. Now let's try this again. S O N I C. Oh, good. He's alive. Where is he? Of course he is. Back at the hotel. Back at the hotel. to recover after Mephiles poisoned him? Mario, I will handle this. You just wait for me by the hotel lobby. Come to think of it, I need to rest too. Thirty minutes later. Still not there, is he? The hotel! What was Sonic thinking? He shouldn't even be back at the hotel. I mean, he still needs to recover. Hey, I know that whistle. It's Sonic, and it's coming from our room. How is that even possible? Why is he taking a shower? This game is so stupid, I love it! This is the most stupidest game I ever played. <laughs> Sonic, you don't necessarily need a robe, but whatever. This is the game. The game does whatever it wants. Hey there, Sonic. Sonic, what the hell are you doing back at the hotel? You're supposed to be in the hospital. The doctors managed to get out the rest of the poison, so they said I could go. You sure about that? Positive. They told me themselves. Let me tell you, I was sick of wearing that damn oxygen mask. It felt really uncomfortable. But it feels so nice to finally breathe some fresh Rio de Janeiro air after Mephiles poison. Rio de Janeiro air. I did a wow. Laps around the city, and everything feels fine. And then I was like, the first thing I need to do when I get back to the hotel is take a nice hot shower. And that's what I did. How'd you do at the Olympics today, Shonic? I won a silver medal for rugby. That's nice. that now didn't even happen. I, I hope you didn't use up all the hot water. I didn't. I promise you. Five minutes later, did that happen during the thirty minutes? I I swear it didn't. Why is he wearing a robe? That's the first time I've seen you in your bathrobe on this trip. I didn't really wear it a whole lot. Only at the spa. Right. Where's Mario? Dad. Never mind. Come in, Mario. Sonic is okay. Please stop Sonic. with that door. Oh, I'm glad to see that you're okay. Also, nice bathrobe, Sonic. Yeah, they got all the boys, <laughs> and now I'm back on my feet. Now let's get down to business. We need to go over a plan for how we're gonna take care of Zaz, Zavik, and Mephilus. It's too late. They already have your blood sample. The deadly six are probably back by now. And they'll be twice as powerful than the last time I faced them. I don't want you to get hurt again, Sonic. I'm not worried about Mephilus hurting me. I'm more worried about him hurting you guys. The Deadly Six tried to kill both of you in the past. They tried to take you away from me. But there's no way in hell that is happening again. I have a hunch that the Deadly Six will strike during the closing ceremonies at midnight. Right before we have to go back home. So Mari and I will need to use the remaining days of Olympic events to train and prepare ourselves to face the Deadly Six. They won't know what hit them. Shonik, go warn the others ahead of time that the Zeddy have returned. And brought back a more powerful friend to attack the stadium during the closing ceremonies. You don't need to do that right now. But the closing ceremony is in 10 days, and we are running out of time. The three of us are the only ones who are aware of what is happening. Actually, no. I talked to Amy a while ago, so she knows what's going on, and showed his shadow. Okay, now what? You two keep training. I'll go tell everybody what's going on. And what about the other spectators at the closing ceremonies? The Zeti will kill them on the site. Leave that to me. I'll go warn the other athletes at some point. War is coming. War is coming. <laughs> I'm really feeling What? It. Not now, Shulk. Where did he but go? Okay. War is coming. I have a feeling that we'll be outnumbered. Mephilus and the Zeddy will have robots, as well as those fire creatures that I fought in Crisis City. But the only way we'll win against them is together. We are Earth's mightiest heroes. 
We are freedom fighters. We are Avengers. Not unlike Marvel's Avengers, but yes. <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> These mother won't stand a chance against the mascots of Nintendo and Sega. They're also going to have Daleks. Daleks? Yes. As I was going to grab my weapon. I just saw a gun there. Did you guys see that? I saw some Dalek looking machines off in the corner. I hate Daleks. They're the worst. Also, I think Mephilus mentioned something called the Scepter of Darkness. The what? The, the Scepter of Darkness. An ancient artifact that the people of Soliana used to seal Mephilus away in the old times. Where did you hear about this, Shonic? I was in the library one day, doing research for some of my experiments, when I came across a book written by the Duke of Soliana, who you may know as Elise's father, Sonic. He was the leader of the Solaris Project, a project that was supposed to manipulate time with the power of Solaris. The Scepter of Darkness was developed as an emergency measure for the Solaris Project. Where is the Scepter now? Mephilus said that Zaz found it in a dark corner of the world. Maybe he was talking about here in Rio. It couldn't have been back at home. You might be right, Sonic, but didn't you just say that Zaz has the scepter? Yeah, Zaz revived Mephilus, and then Mephilus brought Zavik back to life. So Zaz and Zavik are in possession of the scepter. I have a feeling that they keep it in that creepy old base that we were trapped in. No way in hell I'm going back in there. You don't have to. You and Mario just worry about the Olympics. I'll worry about the scepter. What if they capture you? Or kill you? They won't. I'll be in and out of there. And they won't even hear my footsteps. I'm fast just like you, Sonic. Trust me. I'm gonna be fine. I have my Rubik's Cube with me. That cube hasn't steered me wrong this whole trip. If you say so. Although I never use the yellow side or the orange side, I might find a good use for those eventually. Y'all know your assignments, right? Yeah! Then good luck in the Olympics, you two. And may the odds be ever in your favor. So what do you want to do now, guys? Uh, I'm just gonna keep my bathrobe on for a few minutes because hashtag Sonic the Robe Hog. Yeah, I'm gonna keep my bathrobe on too. Oh, I wish I had the bathrobe. But I could really go for some food right now. How about I order room service and we could get a pizza? Sounds good. Uh, Did you guys hear that? Uh, okay. Three days later. Sonic is sleeping. This is a long cutscene, by the way. What the heck? Ugh. What's happening? Okay, that's a good touch right there. Ah, <laughs> 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 my ears. Wake up the entire hotel. I, I think he already did. The rooms are soundproof. Nobody's gonna hear me. Somebody could be having sex in the room right next door. What? I wouldn't know because I can't even hear what the f*** is going on in there. Is everything okay, Sonic? No. I had another bad dream. Is it that same bad dream you've had three nights in a row? Yeah, I've been having trouble sleeping lately ever since Mephilus poisoned me and I woke up in the hospital. Just go back to bed, Sonic. <laughs> I can't go back to bed, Sonic. Don't you see? The nightmares involving Mephilus are only getting worse. And when I fall right out of bed, I feel like I'm back in the hospital. And I can hear Mephilus laughing in the background. <laughs> I'm going to find the Scepter of Darkness soon. Besides, you need some sleep. You have the Olympics to worry about. Where are you going? I'm going to talk to Mario. It's 3 in the morning. Mario's probably asleep by now. Yeah, 3 in the morning is not the best time to be awake, Sonic. Like he has to know. I'm really worried about you, Sonic. I hate seeing you like this. And <laughs> I hate like this. Not being able to sleep because of Mephilus. It's like Harry Potter when he keeps having visions of Voldemort. Except in my case, it's a million times worse. Maybe you can listen to your iPod. Music really helps when you're trying to fall back to sleep. Great idea. 
Good night, Sonic. Sonic has an iPod of a so play music video. I I actually have an option here if I want to play. I mean I don't know if it's copyright, but ah, let's go ahead. <laughs> 